Hello, today we are going to be reviewing how to view your class schedule and other important class information. The first thing you want to do is log into ACES. Once in ACES, you will be brought to this home page. On the left hand side, click on the student tab. Next, click on register here area. Then click on Proceed to Registration. Next, click on the View Registration Information. Next, click the term that you would like to view. I am going to select Fall 2021. This is going to bring up all the classes that I have signed up for for the fall semester. Next, click on Active Registrations up here at the top. Now I want you to pay attention to this part, Instructional Methods. This is a quick way to tell if your classes are face-to-face, -face, meaning that you will physically be meeting with your professor and other students on campus, or if your class is a fully distance education course, meaning that you will not meet face-to-face -face with your professor, you will not have a Zoom lecture with them either. The professor will only be communicating with you through Canvas and email, and your assignments and readings will all be posted on Canvas. It can also be a hybrid slash blended course like this one, meaning that your lecture will be online, so no physical or Zoom interaction with the professor, but your laboratory will be on campus, so you will be meeting on designated days and times with your professor and other students on campus. But let's go back and look up a schedule. Now we're going to click on this triangle here in the center of the page to widen the area that we're trying to see. Now if we scroll down we can see what our physical schedule looks like. Uh, keep in mind that this only shows the lectures or labs that we physically have to meet in person uh, or on Zoom. It will not show your online classes since those will not have a physical meeting place. Uh, but let's go ahead and get more information so let's click on schedule details right over here. So here I can see that I am signed up for four classes for the fall semester. I can see my class name, so Clinical Diagnostic Medical Sonography. Um, I can see the course number, which is right here. The start and end date of the semester. What days the class meets, so this one is Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Uh, what time it meets, 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. I can see that this is a clinical type of class, uh, location none, building none, room none, because I know exactly where I'm going to be going to the hospital for this. Um, let me scroll down here. Let's pay attention to the type of class it is. Uh, this is very important because, as you can see, if it says internet like this one down here, that means that everything will be online. So as you can see, it says none for location, building, and room. That means that I will not be meeting face-to-face -face with my professor. Uh, I will not have a Zoom lecture with them either. The professor will only be communicating with me through Canvas and email, and all my assignments and reading will be posted on Canvas. And down here you can see who the instructor is too, so Heather Wright. Now let me look for another class. Um, for example, this one here is known as a hybrid course because you can see the lecture portion of the class is going to be on the internet so for location none, building none, room none because it's all on the internet. Um, for the laboratory portion though as you can see laboratory I'm going to actually be going to St. Phillips College and the Center for Health Professors building in room 116 on Tuesdays from 1210 to 1 p.m. so this is a hybrid course and this over here is what most of the classes are going to look like. So this is a face-to-face -face class. My laboratory is at St. Philip's College uh, Center for Health Professions, room 116. Uh, my class or lecture is also at St. Philip's College, the same building, the Center for Health Professions, but it's a different room number, 114. Uh, my laboratory is on Thursdays from 10.05 to 10.55, and on Tuesdays from 10 a.m. to 11.40 is my class. But that's all I have for you today. Just keep an eye out for more how-to videos that your academic advisor will be sending out periodically. Just thanks for watching and have a great semester.